Salut mes petits loups, aujourd'hui j'espère que vous allez bien. Euh, là, ouais, on change de jeu là, ça va être. Euh... Alors, attendez, je me rappelle même plus du nom du jeu. <rire> Alors c'est. Ah, je sais plus. C'est un jeu de tir. C'est tellement Red Dead Redemption que celui-là, je m'en rappelle plus. C'est de la merde. Ça commence déjà magnifiquement bien. Call of Juarez. Voilà. Donc, alors, voilà. Gunslinger. Alors, par contre, attendez. Parce que, ouais, on va commencer par jouer. Histoire. Voilà. Alors, comme j'avais déjà fini le jeu une fois, on peut reprendre là. Voilà, nouvelle partie. Oui. Mais par contre, on va essayer en difficile. Alors, déjà en normal, il était pas évident. Parce que pour avoir quelques bas, ouais, c'était dur. Là, je garde les atouts, euh, tout ce que j'avais débloqué d'avant. Mais euh, on, va essayer, on va essayer en difficile, on verra bien ce que ça va Advienne que pouvoir. Voilà. Histoire m'a un peu foulé, mais bon c'est plus le game que le jeu. Pour faire simple en gros, c'est un gars qui, qui vient raconter sa vie avant le salon. Don't I know you, sir? Don't believe so. I haven't been here in many years. Name's Silas Greaves. Silas Greaves? The bounty hunter? Used to be. Ah, well, what are you doing here in Abilene? Just passing through. Got a little business to take care of. Well, sir, it would be an honor if you would allow me to buy you a beer. Hell, son, it would be my honor to drink it. I'm Molly. Howdy. Uh, I'm Dwight. That's Jack and Steve. Ben's behind the bar. Oh, I bet you got some great stories. A couple. <laughs> Any of them true? Jack, be nice. A few. What about your shootout with Henry Plummer's gang in Bannock, Montana? Is that where you started as a bounty hunter? That's what it says in this here dime novel. Voilà. Donc là on doit rejoindre Billy the Kill. Ouais. Là pour démarrer la partie. Voilà. It was about 30 years ago. Bon, niveau tir, ça sera peut-être pas le luxe. Hein. Billy was hiding out in an abandoned en fait, farm near Stinkin' Springs. Nous, en fait, ce qu'il est, ce qu est en train de raconter. Hein. I threw in with the kid because the man I had sworn vengeance on was riding with voilà. Billy's enemies. But before I tell you why I want that son of a bitch dead. Let me tell you what happened that day. I was heading back to the hideout when suddenly I had this funny feeling. Funny, haha. No, Steve. The other kind of funny. Quand il raconte l'histoire, il est en train de la modifier. C'est-à-dire que le décor que vous voyez, c'est en train de se réécrire et c'est en train de se de changer. C'est un petit peu humoristique, mais. I knew those two morons would never let me through. I had no choice. Is he with us? Bing bing. Was it Pat Garrett's posse? Oh yeah. I heard the shots and I knew I had to move fast. Garrett and his army of deputies had surrounded the entire homestead. I decided to help Billy and the boys out of it. So that's just what I did. As the governor of New Mexico was paying for the kids' apprehension, Garrett was able to hire every gun hand at Lincoln County. Still, one of them reached the water tower. It would be a turkey shoot from up there. Garrett's men were running around like a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off. Luckily, these shooters Garrett hired weren't the sharpest tools in the shed. A lot of them were saddle traps, sod busters, or drunken drifters looking to make a few bucks. Voice yelling at me from the wind. Back door! We'll cover you! Drop aiming, you idiots! 
Truth be told, things weren't much better behind the house. I cut their numbers in half. But that just made the ones that were left twice as mad. They made up for their lack of skill with a seemingly endless supply of uh -huh. ammo. It was a bit of a slog, but I finally fought my way around the back of the house. And like that, I was inside. None the worse for wear. I passed Dirty Dave, and upstairs I found Billy and Charlie Bolton. Voilà, lui c'est Billy avec le gosse. Maintenant comment ça marche Billy looked at me and said, About time, amigo! Grab a gun and get to the window! Wait, so you were friends with Billy the Kid? Winchester? Yeah, sort of. Anyway, we were surrounded by dozens of deputized shooters who wanted to do us home. Et en plus pour recharger, comme j'avais débloqué un truc, parce que c'est hyper long de recharger normalement dans le commence le jeu. Et moi en fait plus j'appuie sur la touche recharge vite et plus je recharge vite, plus je dépêche d'en mettre les gars. Je vous dis que vous Garrett's men were dropping like flies, but they just kept on the That's when Charlie got hit. They're catching us in a crossfire, shouted Billy. Get to the other side! Pretty clear, even the village, yeah. that maybe discretion was the better part of valor. What's that mean? It means that it was time to cut and run. They got a gatlet, Billy shouted. Get the horses and bring them around back. I'll draw their attention. He directed that order at me, and I thought, what the hell do I have to do? Huh? Many would have fled in my place. But I had that false sense of invincibility that many young men have. Like Jack here. What are you saying, old man? Jack, he was joshing with you. Yeah, he better be. Mr. Graves, please continue. Please, call me Silas. Now, where was I? You were heading for the bar. Right. Making my way past a passel of fallen foes. Allez, on recharge. Ah, super. J'ai super. On va recharger. Sounds like Garrett hired a whole regiment of hard guns. Yeah, just when I thought I was done with them, more of these hapless bastards would pop up. Yeah, and just when I thought I was done with them, more of these hapless bastards would pop up. Finally, I had the stables within my reach. After the fight, maybe we could treat ourselves to some fried chicken. And that's when I met Sheriff Pat Garrett. I read that you went toe to toe with him, sir. That backstabbing bastard with that tacked on tin star. On a le droit à des duels aussi. Peut-être que là il y en aura un. Je sais plus du tout. Vous challenged him to a showdown. 
You read that in a dime novel? It said he showed no fear as he took your measure with eyes like a rattlesnake. Ah ouais, je dois mettre ça sur lui. Super, on est mort tous les deux. Super. qu'il fallait cliquer deux fois ah je m'a je sais plus quoi les duels je sais plus vous êtes prêt à tirer vous pouvez gagner le premier mais l'histoire se souviendra Il se passe pour continuer. Ouais, bah c'est ça. Tout le monde se tape tous les boss fastoche. Voilà. En 0,2 secondes. Hein. Ouais bon. Putain, je crois que ça va être prise de tête. Ça. Je crois que ça va être prise de tête. Alors, faut que j'entende mon cœur battre, je crois. Ah, il est là. Oh, tiens. And that you killed him in a fair fight. <laughs> Is that what that penny dreadful said? No, boy. That ain't what I meant when I said I met Pat Garrett. Nous tire dessus pour être loyal. So let me start again. Uh, I finally reach those damn stables. Step inside and last thing I heard was Garrett's voice. That's not Billy. And go on. How did it end? And boy, that was just the beginning. Je là c'est vrai que recommencer 50 fois récompense favorite en pleine tête. Ouais. Tu es 65, c'est bien, c'est bien, ça va. Ça va, ça va, ça va. Alors, je démarre la mission. Non, 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 <rire> non, non, pas redémarrer la mission. Non, qu'on va faire continuer. Mais... Putain, il me lance à la mission. So what happened? Did Garrett arrest you? Yeah, after I came to, bastard had clocked me with his cult. Oh merde. Bastard clocked his cult. And the kid surrendered when he realized there was no getting out of there alive. So they locked you up in Lincoln? Indeed they did. Sentenced me to hang right along with the kid. Mais ça s'est pas passé comme ça. It's important to know that I was only riding with Billy so I could find the bastard I was after. C'était un truc de duel. He was with John Kinney's gang. They were sworn enemies of Billy's regulation. 
Why yeah. were you after me? I owed that son of a bitch a bullet for what he had done to me and mine. Instead, all I got for myself was a goddamn death sentence. Ah. Luckily, it was right around then that I heard Billy make his move. He shot Jim Bell and a few other guards as he made his getaway. Later, they wrote that some lady friend planted a pistol for him in the privy. What the papers didn't say is that Billy helped me escape too. My first order of business was finding a firearm. Luckily, I located Deputy Bob Ollinger's mean ass shotgun. couper un homme en deux mm. <rire> bon I saw Billy through the window and he yelled that I should take to the rooftops to make my escape so I did anybody see Billy oh. ah, d'accord c'est vraiment le mode difficile hein. je suis mort mais on sait pas comment <rire> Hell yeah. yeah! That scatter gun was like a double-barreled howitzer. It could blow a man clear off his feet. You hardly had aim at that. Guards were everywhere looking for him. Can't let the kid get away. Ah, well, you know. C'est où Fier, toi en toi. I had to jump from roof to roof like a damn alley cat. I followed the planks where I could, but some of that wood was slippery as hell. The whole town was up in arms. Ouais, non, ah, c'est pas là. C'est très, très carré. Hein. Hop. De toi en toi. Ok. Je suis mordu. Oh là. Ah oui, d'accord. On descend par là. Je crois qu'en fait, au contraire, c'était là. Ça c'est pas ma part. Voilà. Et là. Faut le deviner le chemin. So that bastard you were after, what did he do? He did me and my family a grievous harm. But I knew if I was ever going to find him, I would need to get my ever-loving ass out of there. I tried to be stealthy and sneak my way past. Oh, j'ai plein de balles. Surtout pistolet. Par là. You. But hell, if they weren't all waiting. C'est dommage qu'il y ait un peu trop d'écrit. Vous voyez pas si je tire bien. Ou euh. Ou pas. Mais si, je vous rassure, je tire bien. Ça, c'est mon âme, mon âme. Hop, ça va Ça, c'est bon. C'est vrai que ça pardonne pas, là, on est. <rire> Et boum. Smelly, sweaty, ungrateful beasts. 
Traverser en too high. Traverser la ville, mais par où Et voilà. C'est peut-être par là. Non. Je sais pas si c'est par là. C'est par là. Non, c'est par là. <rire> J'ai eu la confirmation. J'entends parler. C'est qu'il y a du monde. Essayez de se servir un peu plus de ça. Merde oh. Putain, j'aurais pu la garder. Pour... Ah So I could be a hapless decoy and draw attention while he snuck out of town. I knew if I made it out of there in one piece, no one would have passed by. Because everybody in Lincoln would be dead. They all thought I was Billy. And all that blame would fall on him. Meanwhile, Deputy Bob Ollinger was organizing a posse to put me down. He was already a mean son of a bitch, but he was doubly pissed that I stole his mean ass shotgun. Taking out Bob Ollinger the way he did. Billy didn't kill Bob. Sure he did. Dispatched him right after he shot Deputy Bell. No, sir. Because Bob came right up behind me, angry as hell that Billy had lit out. Hello, Bob. I said. I think you better let me go. And he says, I don't think so, boy. Not with my shotgun. So we stood there in the middle of the street. Eyeball to eyeball. He intended to kill me, and I knew I had no choice but to defend myself. Je crois qu'il faut cliquer quand lui va mettre sa main sur le pistolet en fait. Je dois y mettre une balle dans le ventre, lui. <rire> c'est évident. Comme c'est évident. Je sais pas, il y a peut-être une touche. Pourtant, il n'y en a pas 50 des touches. Hein. Some say I fought unfairly. But they weren't the ones looking him in the eye. That Garrett gunned down Billy three months later, so his escape was off and on. Super. Ah, ouais, bah voilà. Tu vas chier. So where'd you go after Lincoln? Mexico. Until I realized nobody was looking for me. I ended up taking a job with the Rurales. The Mexican Rurales? I was hired to help them track down the cowboys. The most vicious outlaw gang in Cochise County? Curly Bill Brocious, Johnny Ringo? Led by old man Clan himself. They must have paid you a pretty penny to take them hombres on. 
not really. But truth be told, I had my own reasons for going after those boys. Ah. Voilà. Bon, sur ce, mes petits loups, non, parce que là, ça charge pour l'autre, pour l'autre niveau. Il est en train de se les enchaîner comme ça. Mais écoutez, on se dit au revoir maintenant, et puis euh, on reprendra après euh, pour pour la suite en, en vidéo. <rire> voilà. Et puis j'essaierai de m'entraîner pour les duels au passage, et je vous dis à bientôt. Allez, à plus tard. Ciao, ciao.